13 points. How satisfied are you quarter way into this, this, into the season, if I can get my words out? <laughs> yeah, it's been a good start. It's been decent points, Tally. Um, you know, without being too greedy, we're probably disappointed we haven't got a couple more points. I think we've done well in the games. Uh, not really been blown away as such by any of the teams so far. Um, like I say, we've made a, a decent enough start, but you know we can't settle. We want to we want to kick on and, and pick up even more points over this next period. How much confidence do you, do you take from recent performances? Unbeaten in the last three at Watford, dominating the ball for most of the game, beating Arsenal at Bramall Lane, and then at West Ham coming back in and getting another priceless point on the road. Yeah, I mean to go three games unbeaten for us is is a, a decent achievement. Um, as you say, we keep working. You know, it's going to be a different test on Saturday to what we've had in the the previous three games and. Now for us, how long can we go and beat and how long can we keep it going? Um, we spoke about making it difficult for teams to come to Bramall Lane. I think we did that against Arsenal and you know that's got to be the stop performance for us this season. It can't just be a one-off against Arsenal, that's got to be every week. And, and starting in games as well and getting those starts right at West Ham, Chris Wilder wasn't particularly happy with the way that the first <laughs> half an hour or so went and I'm sure he's told you all about it, but what's the key to, to getting those starts right in games? Just being prepared, I mean, I think... Maybe looking back, the Arsenal game maybe took a lot out of us on the Monday night. We put a lot into that. Um, maybe we started a bit slow at West Ham, and you know, let's be honest, they're not a, a mug team. Are they West Ham? They're, they're a fantastic football team, and spent a hell of a lot of money at the top of the pitch. Um, England internationals playing in midfield, so it's not as if we're playing against teams in League Two. We're playing against proper Premier League teams, and they were at it. We weren't. Uh, we hung in there as we always, you know, we 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 do that. We stuck together. Going at half time and second half, I thought we we really kicked on and possibly, you know, it was probably a fair result in the end. And as I say, we come away happy after the first half an hour. How is life in the Premier League comparing to what you thought it might be at the start of the season? It's been what you expect. It's been difficult at times. It's you know the game's a lot quicker. Uh, you find at the top of the pitch and on the counter attack, the teams are a lot more athletic than than what we come up against last year on the Championship. And I think a couple of times we've made mistakes. We've been ruthlessly punished and that's what we found out that you need to cut their mistakes out between us as a group because um, it's difficult enough playing in this division without giving teams a, a, a head start giving them goals Just the, the midfield three and the way you operate together just how well has it gelled do you feel in this start of the season? Yeah it's been good It was worked. we worked on it all the way through pre-season uh, the manager was clearing the system we were going to play we worked hard at it and you know it's not just us. I mean, I think the back five have adapted well, and the front two, whoever plays, I think everybody's adapted well to to the Premier League. And as you say, we've had a decent return, but we want to keep pushing forward now and see how far we can we can keep going.